Hey guys, how's it going? Got a new emoji reviews for you, and today we're looking at motor boats. So there's motorized boats and canoes and sailboats and all sorts of stuff in the emoji world, but today we're looking at the motorized ones, which kind of look like yachts on some of them. All right, so let's take a look at Apple. <laughs> Apple's got this weird stubby yacht. On the one hand, it looks really impressive, and very expensive. Um, with its antennas there and that huge bridge with the big black window and all that stuff. On the other hand, it's so tall and weirdly proportioned that it looks like it would capsize. Doesn't look very seaworthy. Um, so just very weird proportions there. Um, but good details and uh, nice shading and stuff like that. Let's take a look at the others. All right, next up we have Google. And that's a good looking powerboat there. So you can see the the bridge um, looks pretty nice. Nice little cabin there that you can stand in. Uh, you can see the outboard motor on the back there. And it looks like a well-proportioned boat. Like, um, you know, the, the hull isn't <laughs> so ridiculously short and tall like the Apple uh, one was. All right, next let's look at Samsung's. And Samsung's kind of similar to uh, Apple in proportions. Um, really tall, really tall bridge there. Um, it's got that weird like wing or fin or something like that on the top um, above the cabin. And uh, doesn't have the antennas on Apple's, which I thought were pretty cool. But um, yeah, the big black glass, you know, makes it look like one of those really fancy expensive boats um, that are fun to look at. All right, next we have Microsoft, and theirs looks better proportioned, um, although the details are kind of goofy there. Um, it looks good, and uh, they actually had water, so this one uh, is claiming to be seaworthy and is actually uh, at sea right now, rather than these other ones which are up on the dry docks. All right, next is Twitter's. And Twitter's looks like a boat that I could actually afford, <laughs> unlike these other ones. Um, nice little outboard power boat. You might go fishing in that thing. Uh, looks pretty good. And again, this one's in the water too. So, although the water is much calmer uh, than the seas that Microsoft is in. All right, and then finally we have Facebook. And Facebook's got the old, uh, you know. Marina Police <laughs> kind of kind of boat there, the stand-up um, little guy that you see uh, at a lot of like uh, city ports and things like that. So nice detail, different style of boat than any of the other um, emojis they're using too. So that's pretty cool. All right, so today's superstar, the best boat was Google. Um, the details were great, and it looks like just a solid boat, uh, good proportions. All around, uh, excellent powerboat emoji. Next was Facebook, a very realistic mm -hmm. boat. Um, I don't think it was as cool of a uh, vessel as Google's was, but um, in terms of proportions and detail and all that good stuff, it was it was in the same ballpark, which I can't say for any of the remaining four. Next, this is going to be controversial, I'm sure, uh, is Microsoft. Um, I think. The uh, Microsoft proportions look good. Um, it's a solid looking boat. Um, it's definitely in Microsoft's minimal style. Uh, so it doesn't have all the shading and, and glass and stuff like that uh, that Apple and Samsung have. But, you know, it uh, looks like more of a realistic boat. Um, it's not so weirdly proportioned, at least to my eye. Uh, so in that same vein, Twitter is next. That's right, I said it. And uh, with their little fishing boat there, um, I think the Twitter one is really good. Um, I think it could have even beaten Microsoft's, but I like Microsoft's um, rougher seas. And that's the reason it's better. After that was Apple, who had the better of the two bizarro boats that are as tall as they are long, which you will <laughs> never see because it makes no sense to design a boat that way. And then in last place was Samsung. Uh, because it was just so tall and so weird, and the bridge is never that big, 
in relationship to the hull. So that's it for the power boats. Hope you all enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.